We have some social media questions for you. Oh, wow, okay. Love Friends Lover on Instagram. What's your favorite thing to do in your free time? Uh, I know it sounds cheesy, but I love watching, um, uh, just hang with my family, and our favorite show is Wipeout. Have you ever watched really? Wipeout? No. It's on ABC. It's what happens on Wipeout? The best, Larry. It's these, it, these, these people just kind of go through this big... Um, obstacle course and are just knocked over. It's like it's like a live action Buster Keaton pratfall. Families competing, sometimes, but you just see people. It's cr I mean everything's cushioned, but you just see them thrown. It is like physical comedy for an hour. It is, and they. What they kind of prizes do they win? They win like a lot of money. <laughs> it is it is the best. Natasha Rigo on Facebook wants to know how you get into the character to play Buster. How do I get into him? Um, I think it's scary how easily it is to get into it, which really? terrifies me a little bit. I don't know what that says about me. But I think there is, again, I think it's that kind of, you know, physicality in you. Oh, you just kind of, he just, now, anything that comes after you, he's going to be sensitive to. So and if anybody's talking to me, it's just like, oh, well, and you kind of, like, you're just kind of waiting for what's coming at you. So I tend to do that. How do you view him? I think I view Buster as a very, incredibly um, smothered, isolated, sensitive man who has not seen the day of light and has not seen reality. And anytime he comes into reality, it's so overwhelming because it's almost like he's just been in a box his whole life. So he's, he's unhappy? Um, no, I don't know if he's unhappy because in his world, I think he's pretty happy. Like he even had a relationship once with a Roomba. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not kidding. He had a hook because he thought he was a machine, and he saw this vacuum cleaner, <laughs> and he was like, mm, and I remember him going, oh, that's sweet, and he was feeding the Roomba some chips or something like that. It's at, twisted, Larry. It's at, twisted. Yes. At Kimball Chat tweets, what's your favorite cheese? Oh, wow. I have no idea what that means. I don't know. I'm excited. Um, I would say, um, what would I say? A goat cheese. I love I'm goat a Swiss cheese. man. You're a Swiss man. Yeah. I like goat cheese because you can put, like, cranberries in it. It's pretty neat, Larry. R. Vlad Burton on Twitter. Who would win in a fight, Gary Walsh or Buster Blue? Oh, God. Gary would take him out. Take yeah, him yeah. out. Take yeah, Take him out. Well, well maybe with the hook would hurt. I mean, that's not saying a lot, but Gary would take <laughs> him out. Actually, I take that back because this past season, Buster did get a bionic hand where he could easily take somebody out. And he's not even aware of it. He'll just pat someone on the back and they'll go flying. So maybe Buster could take Gary out. If Arrested Development continued, you think Buster would go on to do other crazy... The bionic man? Yes. Yeah.